Good morning, gang. Today is Monday, October 26th. Happy homecoming. Yeah, that's right. It's homecoming week. Today is twin day. Uh, so I hope you are twinning. Anyway, on to today. Uh, we are taking a slight diversion from what we're looking at, but not really because we started looking at our systems of government. And the topic we're going to be looking at is, in fact, related to government. Um, and it's also incredibly timely. I don't know if you know this, but one week from tomorrow, uh, we're having a presidential election. So I think it would behoove us, great word, uh, to take a day or two today and tomorrow to take a closer look at how we elect and select rather a president in the United States. Now this is something that you were likely taught about and you're somewhat familiar with um, but knowing that you know in a weekish we're going to be going through this process again as we do every four years I think it's important that we all have a good understanding of that. Um, and so what you've got today is there's a set of slides in Google Classroom and the slides are really better in a group where there's a lot of discussion going on. Um, and that's a really hard thing to um, do in a, a distance environment. Um, but give it your best. There is plenty of resources and links and videos. And in fact, when you open up the slides, please don't go into presentation mode. Keep it in like the little slide overview where you got all the thumbnails on the left hand side. Because down at the bottom of each slide, there's the little speaker notes section. And I've left a lot of little nuggets in there, uh, just like little links. Uh, additional information, context, directions, all kinds of things. And your task for today is to go through basically the first 18 slides, which is all background, all context. What is the Electoral College? How does it work? Uh, let's take a look at some modern uh, electoral results from the year 2000 onward. Um, let's take a look at some political parties and how that factors in. A little something called swing states, all kinds of stuff that you're going to want to go through today. So today's got some videos, some background. Um, I'd encourage you to share this especially if you're distance learning at home uh, maybe do this activity with someone around your house like a sibling a neighbor a parent an uncle an aunt a grandma whatever you've got um, enjoy this learning process with someone else today because this one like I said is much better served um, doing with somebody else by your side or in a group of people um, and then when you get to slide 18 today where you've basically uh, gotten through the background through those first 18 slides today you stop uh, and there's nothing else you need to do for today just getting through those first 18 slides tomorrow. Oh boy, oh boy. Um, if you look ahead to the slides after slide 18, uh, that's what we're getting to tomorrow. And tomorrow I'm excited because uh, tomorrow we'll get a little prediction segment. Uh, more on that tomorrow. Anyway, I hope you're doing well. If there's anything you need from me, uh, please let me know. Uh, remember, be bold, be kind, and make good choices. Minnesota twins are making Minnesota proud. And we don't buy our titles, so that summer's where we stay. But he's a grown man. He's a grown man. And these are heroes. Please don't call them Twinkies.